Cosmel. 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 Um, watching the boats go. By. Watching the boats go by. People scuba diving. We right out. We right on the balcony. Little, little outfits on. Yep. Let's see if they can see. Y'all see? There you go. You can't see. All right. See, yeah. All right. So um, we are doing um, our review mm -hmm. or whatever. We do a topic uh -huh. from the show Ready to Love because mm -hmm. I'm ready. You know what I'm, I'm ready to love that song. Oh, I hate that song. I hate that song. Like, I that's why I always do it because it's funny. For who sings it. If y'all know, it's funny. Chime in. Okay, so but what I, is your question today? It's not a question. In fact, before we go into the question, um, I just kind of give a brief update um, for that show. I pull something out, and my sister and I talk about it, and we pull it out there to you guys to say, "Hey, what you think about this?" Mm -hmm. Keep in mind, it's a dating show, TV. You know, like other, like Bachelorette and mm -hmm. The Bachelor, mm -hmm. um, and then understanding the process in these shows, you may be connected to one or more person. Mm -hmm. So you, we're finding jealousy in some of the women. Okay. Um, not too much in the men. Okay. I think the men understand the process because you know, men sometimes I say all men, mm -hmm. but a lot of times they like the fact that they can have more than one. You know, I like right. her for her smile and her laughter. I like her because she makes me feel good. Right. You know? So they kind of get the process. You may every once in a while get. A man that's kind of jealous, mm -hmm. but um, <clears throat> Tommy, nephew Tommy, um, introduced his wife again on this show. She's been on another episode, be another season before, mm -hmm. but she came on strong and they had a white party, and that was that evening of that white party where he was kind of telling the women because this is the women's chance to eliminate. Okay, so women look real hard, make sure who is not connecting. Mm -hmm. um, majority of the ladies who say the man, majority of the, the names that come up is the ones that be in the bottom, you know, to be sat sat down. Okay, but um, he introduced his wife. I think twenty one years they've been married. Mm -hmm. okay, okay, right, nephew Tommy. Um, and I'm sure they had some ups and downs in their relationship, but she seems real happy. Okay. She seems like a nice person. You okay. know, you can kind of tell a person's personality. Okay. Like Judge Matthews' wife. Oh, yeah, they're not. You can kind of We tell. haven't done them. Y'all have, have to watch them. No, I'm thinking they're done. They no, done. they're not. Uh, we, we probably need to watch that. Because my mom and I fell in love with Mathis. Mathis we usually come matters. back and do a review of that. So y'all yeah. need to watch his that. His four kids. We got to know okay. them. You do get to know people when you hear from their kids. Right, right. You hear from the wife. Um, and even if it's a, a TV show, you can kind of still tell how their personality is. Right. All right. Go with this. She lays low on that one. Okay. Because he's funny. You know, nephew Tommy crazy. All right. Um, but she just kind of went around and worked her way around and sat down with one of the couples. Okay. And she asked the question. Um, they would say, well, how do you guys keep it good for so long? How do you okay. keep it fresh? How do you keep it whatever? So people was asking them questions. They was asking her questions. Okay. And then when her question came, um, I think they did say, how did you know? How did you know that he was the one? Okay. How did you know? So that's one of the questions that a lot of these couples are kind of feeling their way. If that relationship that they're connecting with, if it's going to go further, mm -hmm. how would you know? I don't know? think you know. I, I'm thinking people know. Oh, as far as marriage, guys don't last. Well, she said, how do you know he's the one to oh, marry? Oh, okay, or right. she's the one to marry. I think you know because you feel like the person, first of all, you feel comfortable with the person, I think. Mm -hmm. Well, this is people who get normal married. Okay. Because there's people who get married for all different kind of reasons. Oh. Mar married for because of financial. Right. People get married for financial, married because you got pregnant, it's married for, for you know, you desperate, you know, you, you know, it could be millions of you drunk, got married in Las Vegas, mm -hmm. but normal, regular, I'm thinking normal people. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of people get married because they feel comfortable with that person mm -hmm. and they feel like that person will be the person they want to spend the rest That's of their life with. That's a strong connection. I can see myself with you in fit four years from now. Uh -huh. Like us being old and still together. Uh -huh. And I think there should be some type of friendship there. You should be, you don't have to be best friends, mm -hmm. but there should be, you should want to be with each other when there's nobody else around. There's a lot of couples that are not friends. I know. I don't understand that because I know you got your group of people you hang with He and he has his group of people. Y'all may have a girls, a uh, women's night out. He has his but some people don't even with, talk to each other. But just friends with each other, talking, um, something you share in common, which brought y'all together in the first place, taking a trip together. One thing I hate, this is a pet peeve of mine, y'all. Y'all may laugh. Oh, yeah. You when I'm at one. restaurants, and sometimes I eat by myself. She I go out and eat by myself because I like just being in a restaurant. Somebody served me, hey, drinking my coffee, whatever. I look at a couple next to yeah. me, a husband and a wife. They're not talking. Yeah, she looked. 
But then There's I've been no out. Conversation. She's looking at her phone or she's looking around. But I told her I've been with somebody for years, and a lot of times you should be a. A lot of times you're so comfortable with that person that you don't have to say anything. When you've been in a relationship for a long time, there should be some type of comfort level where you don't have to You'll say nothing. You'll be okay going out yeah. with somebody and mm -hmm. not talking? Well, not talking at all is different than they, having a full-blown conversation. No, no. I, li I literally count the minutes. And when the they don't say up, nothing? They barely say nothing. The only time they'll say something is if it's dealing with the coffee or something oh, they need okay. to order. But this one couple recently, an older couple, maybe in their maybe 60s, mm -hmm. I look at them, I look at a young couple mm -hmm. where she's just looking at her phone mm -hmm. and playing with the kids, and he's just sitting over there playing on his phone. Well, she with her kids. Well, stuff. no talking yeah. until food comes, and then no, no talking when the food comes. I'm telling you, How I've been... You sit at a table... And not talk. I'm telling you, I've been with people, somebody for years, and it is not uncommon because you've already said what you need to say. And I don't, for you to say no talking, that's different. Mm -hmm. But as far as a full blown conversation, it's no talking. I don't have to have a full blown conversation with you. It's no talking. And I love listening to couples and watching couples that do. Yeah. It's not. And a you gotta also remember everybody don't talk. There, you, she might be with a guy who don't talk, or you no. might be with a woman that don't talk. You see, I was by myself when I was eating. That's what I call go by yourself. Why would I go with you to eat? Because you're comfortable because with each other. No, see, she so don't get like it. like it. You don't mind. I don't mind. I don't, that irks me. I, you know why I don't mind? Because I've been, I'm telling you, I've been with somebody for years, and and you feel comfortable enough with that person. But you would do You don't that. have to you say nothing. Do I've been out with somebody, and I ain't, we didn't talk. No, no talking at all. Well, with, see again. When you say no talking I'm at all, no talking. I say that different. Five ten minutes, no talking. No, at I all. talk like we talk, but not a full blown conversation. Because if you going there to look at people walk by, and it depends on where we came from. If we came from a movie or something, then we'll probably talk about the movie. Yeah. But like, if we just like your kids or grandchildren, yeah. or where are you going today, honey? You going to go to the but then you also got to look at the person. See, I'm the type of person I don't like going out. So it's not uncommon. We won't take you out if you don't like going out. And I'm. It's not uncommon because I'm even with y'all. Mm -hmm. It's not uncommon for me to sit and not say nothing. No, Yo, you talking? True. Yeah. A lot of times I don't say nothing. Oh, I can't go out with you then. Yeah. Uh. Uh. I don't like dead converse. No conversation. Yeah. You gonna it talk? Don't make sense to me. And then you gotta remember what do we talk about? A lot of times when we talk about, we talk about other people. So if it's a or guy... Our, or our family doing stuff. Our but I'm parents. saying a lot of times if it's a guy, he ain't going to be talking about other people. You know what? That's a, That should be a question. I, I thought about how would you know. And people don't... How do you, How would you know when that person is the right one? We can be all over the place with that. Because you have to be the person to have that feeling and that, mm -hmm. that thing. It's not a cut, dry answer. It's how you feel, how you're related. The question really the question should, should be to the man. Because how do he know to ask her? Well, I'm saying I was thinking about having that as the question, but uh, now I'm pulling it out. And what you think having a question of what we just talked about with the table? If you see a couple at the table talking, when you be concerned that they don't say nothing to each other? Okay, so we'll ask that question. Because to me, I, I, I to I, me, I don't care. She says it bothers her. For me, her. that's what the purpose of a restaurant is. The environment uh -huh. of a restaurant is to come, sit, eat, enjoy one another's company. So the real not sit there all quiet. So the real question for the day is. <laughs> Not about how do you know if somebody yes, for you or not. Yes, yes. Is do you think that a person people can go out as a couple uh -huh. and sit in the, at a table at a restaurant and, that's and not nothing. have any conversation and that's okay? My answer is yes. I don't think so. Her answer is no because I'm saying I've been with somebody for years and a lot of times I don't we we don't really need this we we're comfortable with each other enough to where we don't have to keep talking. Because it's almost like me sitting there and somebody join. Hey, can I join you? If you're joining me at a table, there's mm -hmm. going to be a conversation. That's different. Maybe not a lot. Mm -hmm. We're not. If I'm saying. And I don't join me. I don't like when people join me. I, well, that's different. Yeah. But I'm just saying, as far as my my spouse, if he's out about, he comes mm -hmm. and sits with me. Um, I don't expect him to be quiet. You know, when he's sitting with me and we just see, I'm okay with that because he we have tell me what's going on. You do no. I, I don't think in the day we already talking at home. No, I don't no, need you to no. say that. We need to have a conversation while we're all out. right. So you different? Yeah, I'm different because I go out by myself. But see, the person if I don't want to talk. But the person who would be going out with you would know that. 
That's what I'm saying. I don't want him coming with me if we're not talking. No, but he knows that. He knows you. He would be the type of person that knows you don't want to go out unless you're talking. Well, see, and he was whereas home. somebody with me would say, I'm, Kim's good. We don't have to converse. We don't have converse. to talk. What is that, the right word, converse? Yeah. She okay. good. Because she don't hardly like going out anyway. Well, so she good with just going out. Let's eat our food. If I do, now, again, let's, it's levels to this. Okay. When you say talking for me, I don't have to have a full blown conversation. No, no, no. That's what I'm saying. You need to ask the question the right yeah, way. Yeah, I'll ask it. I'm not now. Me. Not talking like, oh, this, oh, uh, something like. If um, I'm sitting by you, you like your, you like your, do you like minutes? that? And I, I would say something like, how do you like that steak? Yeah, I like that steak. It's good. Thank something you. like that. No. When you say no talking, no talking see? for at least twenty minutes. After they reviewed the menu, okay. What about order, not that? Because that's that's, a that's long weird. Time. What about what I said? Where it's not what a conversation? Because I've I've seen people probably think I'm weird when I kind of look at couples and stuff. Because I like to see people in and conversing with one another mm -hmm. out together. All right. If it's just like you looking at your phone, she's staring me in my face. He's on the um, reading a book. Why you come out together? Because they wanted to eat out. Um, she maybe want to cook. She didn't want to cook, but they probably do that at home. You think? Yeah, they don't talk at home. Yeah, they probably don't talk. Wow, but uh, understand that's that people probably laughing like, why is that a pet peeve for you? I know that's, that's nothing funny. to do with you. That's a, that's it, it just makes me go. All right, oh. so we'll ask that question. Okay. Y'all may think, think I'm weird for thinking that, but I'm no, sorry. it's probably other people think like you. Okay. The when we put this stuff up on the community tab, mm -hmm. you'd be surprised at how people answer. They may think I'm crazy. I asked some Your questions. Crazy. I don't know why she think that. I asked some questions that people answer, and y'all answer ways I never thought y'all would answer. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Like I put one question up. I said, "Would you take advantage? Or would you um like take advantage of somebody if you could or whatever?" I was surprised at how many people would. <laughs> I've done it and not even realize it. No, on purpose. Ooh, on purpose. Yeah. Take Just advantage. different stuff. That's a good question. I missed that survey. It's on there. Would you take advantage of someone on purpose? Like it's on purpose? And one of, the, and one of the responses was, it depends on who the person is. I thought people would answer that. It depends on who it is. Some people just said yes. And it what do you mean by take advantage? A hustle them if you can or whatever. Get your hustle on if you want to. I think I did that more younger when I was in my... my, my Maybe that's the people who saying yes. Because I'm getting older. They younger. Like, I don't have time. Most people say read what you sow, no, because it's going to come back to you and oh, stuff like that. okay. So it just depends. That's a good question. It just depends. Okay. So okay. we'll put that up there. Okay. All right, y'all. Did you have anything else? No, I just wanted to kind of briefly talk about that with um, Tommy's wife. We, we didn't even talk about that. We talked about the restaurant thing. Well, she so. asked that one main question. They asked her and Tommy. And maybe that same question, too. How, how do you know it's know? the one? How, did you know? how do you know it's the person? How do you and know it's the one? she gave the same points that we said. So two questions. How yeah. do you know it's the person that you want to marry or be with for the rest of your mm -hmm. life? And then are you able to go to a, a restaurant and... Not have a conversation with somebody, be okay with that. So, how would I know if he really loves me? Okay, that just came to me. How would I know? Okay, all right, all right, all right, so don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Uh -huh. Remember, YouTube is not a human being, it's a computer. Okay, so it only knows if you click if a button, doing the click on the button, all right, okay, and don't stop believing. Well, I guess we should say, don't. Always believe. Always believe. Because I keep thinking of that song. You're right, you're right. Don't stop believing. All right. Da, 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 da. Don't All right. stop believing. <laughs> I love that man's holler. All right, holler. All right so him, we'll say, we'll say, um, Ooh, and, good. And, believe. and believe. And believe. All right. Believe. Always believe. Okay. All right. And that was another, another Woods, Woods Report. Report. See you later.